Welcome beautiful Paris and gentlemen family. Today I will be talking about oh, Kylian Mbappe once again. So obviously in the press conference Nasser Khalifi came out with this straight statement. A lot of people were expecting him you know to say something beautiful. So uh, Mbappe is our player and want him to say. But no Nasser was clear. He was clear as daylight. Either Mbappe or Muniz with the one plus year or the new contract that they are preparing for him or we sell him and this is all by 31st of july so, so mbappe has about what 25 days on him to to make a decision uh, but i believe it's it's way too late if you want to replace him we want to be early on because if you want to go for for example a rafael leao even though we extended recently if, if you want to go for rafael leao you want to get him as soon as possible because milan don't want to sell towards the end of the transfer window they would rather want to sell now so they can get a replacement so this Mbappe stuff it, it gets me it gets everybody crazy including real fans including the entire football world i just it's crazy it's crazy. And what Mbappe is doing now, it's disgusting. It's literally disgusting. Like, all right, you want to leave? All right, we can sell you. Mbappe, you can go this summer to Real Madrid, your boyhood club, your favorite club, your this club. But you're saying you want the wage for next season? How is that even possible? How is that even legal? I don't understand. I mean, I don't understand. Like, why are we supposed to give him the wages for next season, this season? It's a loyalty bonus, so it's not included as a wage. It's something extra. Like, why is Mbappe putting us in this hard of a situation? If you want to leave, leave. No, but he wants to do it his way. He wants to leave next year for free, but then we don't get any money. I... Why are you doing this, Mbappe? Like, if, if you do this and you stay for next season, I hope every PSG fan boos you. Because you definitely deserve to be booed. If Messi and Neymar got booed for, I don't know, got, getting injured and not performing versus Bayern, you definitely need to get booed for this. Obviously, listen, all the blame should go onto my club. Because they put themselves in this position. They extended a player that wanted to leave. With an immense big contract. With loyalty bonuses. With everything. We just made everything harder for us. But... I don't have an answer. Like, I don't have an answer to anything. I don't know what PSG should do in this situation because it's such a disgusting situation. It's such a disgusting situation. And yeah, Mbappe is not making it easier. I don't know why he's doing this. I don't know why. And he's putting out in the media, he wants to stay at PSG, la, 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 la. But then the royalty bonus, like, rat. Fucking rat. Fucking rat. Um... Should we keep him, lose him for free next season, then we don't have to... Uh, I mean, we still will pay the loyalty bonus and we don't even get any money. But then we will have Kylian Mbappe, you know, for one year. Or we sh should we sell this summer, get, what, 100? Because we, we will pay 8 million, his loyalty bonus, and then get, like, 180 from Real, which means we'll go profit 100 million and try to replace Mbappe with 100 million. But then you don't have Mbappe for one year. Guys, let me know in the comments down below. Should we sell him now? Get 100 million? Or have him for one year? You know, get the best out of Mbappe for his last year. Then he goes for free. We don't get any money. You decide in the comments down below. Because I don't have an answer. I really don't have an answer. I really don't have an answer. Allez Paris.